how you do, but this is going on my second channel uh, because it's mostly an audio visual test for when we play this but we're also gonna unbox this today. So it's City Skylines, the board game. And it was given to me, it was purchased from my throne list by Red Crayon Brigade. So if you're still out there, thank you. Thank you so much. I don't know what you're gonna be hearing in the background of this. I'll do my best to get rid of it. But City Skylines, the board game. I'll read you the back. The cooperative board game based on the hit video game, the ultimate city building game lands on your tabletop. From the best selling video game of the same name comes the cooperative board game where players work together to plan, build, and manage a city. Players begin with a blank canvas, a vacant plot on which they must develop residential, commercial, and industrial areas, gradually creating new neighborhoods. However, the key to successfully developing a city is maintaining a happy population. As players decide how and where to build, they must consider a variety of factors such as the environment, crime, traffic flow, education, and financial resources. Players must work strategically in order to succeed, always keeping the satisfaction of their citizens in mind while balancing the budget. Starting with an entry level scenario, each subsequent scenario adds new challenges and additional in-game elements. The increasing complexity makes City Skylines the perfect cooperative board game for newcomers and veteran gamers alike. Wow! So it says it's for one to four players, age is 10 and up, so we should be okay. And playtime 40 to 70 minutes. You can see the plastic is still on it. So this is like a real unboxing. I don't know what's in this thing. And I'm gonna try to get it open without damaging the box itself. Okay. I'm very excited. Yeah, it's like Christmas. Okay. City Skylines the board game. Ready? I'm going to put it right there. Hopefully you can see it. Uh, we got stuff. We have stuff. We have, oh, it smells like, uh, you know, it smells like newly unboxed things. I just smelled a box on the video. That's good. Uh, City Skylines, the board game. This is probably the rules and stuff. Yes. Cool. So it's got like eight pages. Okay, good. I'll be curious to be reading those. And then, oh, these are like building tiles, I guess. Oh, the, oh, these pop out. Okay, we'll deal with those in a second. Um, oh, does this pop out too? What's going on here? I don't wanna pop anything that shouldn't be popped. Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, I think these do, I think you are supposed to bring these out. I'm gonna like, Brutus just having a quick casual drink. Can you be done, please? <laughs> He's a thirsty boy. <laughs> so I believe that these kind of, it looks like everything here you are intended to pop out. So I'm gonna pop it out. Yeah, it comes out really easily. You can really tell that this is, this is what's supposed to happen here. So I probably just ruined, you know, collector's value, but I'm not a collector person. Uh, so there's like, Roads. Ooh, these are six lane roads with trees. Very cool. And it says E on the back. I don't know what that means. But uh, there's quite a few. I think there's like five of these main tiles. It looks like I might be wrong. I think the box said six, so I probably just can't see one. A. Okay, so I have a necklace now. Oh, I'm really cool. Whoever would have thought at 32, I would be sitting here unboxing a City Skylines board game using the card knockout piece as a necklace because I'm just that cool. Yeah, so here. Okay, more tiles. And then on this one, we've got a whole whack of money. Um, this, I don't know what this is. We got some little smiley faces. And then, oh, I keep like knocking them out. Uh, these must be residential squares. We've got 
Oh, this dark blue you would think would be like high density commercial, right? But um, these are like the unique buildings that are in the game. That's the posh mall. Oh, that's the life and death fountain. Oh man, this is so cool. The opera house. And then what are these? These are obviously, those are industrial places. Ah, oh, here's the sixth, um, the sixth map tile. Pop that out. Neat. Uh, on this, I don't know what these are. These are all like the service symbols. That looks like a credit card looking thing. Um, this must be like how you get your scores or whatever. I don't know yet. We have more industrial. These definitely look like commercial here. Oh, one of these popped out. Uh, I don't know. Oh, these are water services. Oh, cool. Yeah, this is water, electric, like power, trash all the other services, and then more money, and Chirper! Let's get Chirper out of here. It's Chirpy! Chirper, Chirper, right? We also have whatever this is. Um, oh, you know what, these are probably, the yeah, other just Ziploc bags, and they're just a store, I'm sure. The pieces in, that's cool. Um, but we have some card packs. So this one says City's News, and this one says End of a Milestone. So I'm gonna open these up. This makes me think of opening up a cigarette pack. So yeah, city's news, city's news, city's news. Um, not enough goods to sell. Whenever commercial, I don't know, is built in district, there is no industry minus two money. Immediately valid will be placed by, will be replaced by another news card or discarded at the end of the milestone. What? Okay, so that's all the news thingies. And then we have policies. Oh my gosh, it's like the actual policy. Well, never mind. They're not all the actual policies. We do have distribution of smoke detectors, so minus money, but plus one happiness per fire boy. Um, and then we have some that are not familiar like with the game. Switch to LED street lights, minus three money, plus two power. Um, construction of new bike paths. Oh, so those are, those are the policies. I don't know what this is, advisors. Oh, this kind of reminds me of like, the little bit that I've played any of the SimCities. Go find that on my main channel. I played all the SimCities for the first time as like a City Skylines player who had never played SimCity before. It's a lot of fun. Advisor, and it's some cool looking dude with aviators who actually just kind of looks like a middle-aged asshat. Um, if you exchange a card as your action, you may pay two money and take a look at the top two cards in any pile of your choice. Place one of those cards in your display and the other bottom of the pile. And the other at the bottom of the pile. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, we got a bunch of, we have a lawyer. Uh, if you build an empty city district plus one happiness. Um, oh, we got, a, we got a happy gardener boy. Um, yeah, these are cool. So that's all those. And then, ah, these are unique building cards. And it's all the cards that we, I think all of the unique buildings that we know. Like there's the Posh Mall, the Opera House, Science Center, and they have stuff that happens when you build them. The Courthouse. If you build a service building in this district, I think, you may move the marker one additional space on the corresponding bar. No idea what anything that means. So that's cool. That came from the first card pack. And then the second card pack is here. Um, hello? So, oh, oh, there's a lot of, there's a lot of things happening here. So we have end of a milestone. Oh, I think this just like is a thing that tells you, I don't understand. End of a milestone for each. Whoa, there's, there's just, there's so much going on there that I don't understand. Uh, we have a few, four, four turn overviews. Ah, these just tell you. So each player I assume holds this and it just tells, tells you how a turn works. Play a construction card. Place building or zone on the game board. Pay costs. Receive benefits, if any apply, from service buildings. Draw one card of your choice. Or you can exchange a construction card minus two money. Place one card face up on exchange pile and draw one card of your choice or and a milestone prerequisite there must be at least one zone or building in every district for the last milestone at least to follow the end of a milestone card cool we have a few industrial zone cards which look like they do different things we have uh, a few commercial zone cards it's for each i wonder if it's one per player oh no because here's a whack of residential cards whack of Residential cards. 
These are all services. Ooh, a botanical garden. They're just all like ploppable buildings, university, oil power plant, botanical garden. Oh, and then there's more industrial zones. I'm gonna put them together with the other ones. I'm probably gonna regret it. Yes, and then here's more ploppable buildings like the Bouncy Castle Park, a police station, a high school. They all look, uh, the pictures on the cards all look like they're taken from screenshots in the game. It's really cool. And then more ploppable buildings, um, medical clinic. Oh, they even have like the European looking police station and then they have the Western looking Euro European station. Landfill site, wind turbine. Very cool. So that's the City Skylines board game. I don't know how to play it, but I hope I'm gonna find out. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching this unpacking video because I guess that's a thing that I do now. If you aren't already subscribed to my main YouTube channel, it's youtube.com slash toadyypq. That's where I do all my like cool stuff. City Skylines videos, tips, tricks, tutorials, challenges. And in the near future, hopefully a board game let's play with other fine folks playing City Skylines board games. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for hanging out. I'll catch you next time.